In continuing my uh, character sketches of Walking Dead survivors, I'm doing one on Tara here, and I've only got one picture saved of her. Not because she hasn't been in some cool scenes or had cool pictures of her, but there hasn't been very many of them. Um, she hasn't really stood on her own in a lot of ways. She's what I would consider a sidekick character so far. I mean, she's a really cool um, character, but she hasn't been the center protagonist in, in any episodes yet. Um, she's been kind of a, like, almost like a supporting character. I, I guess it's probably the, the more somatic term or something that other people use. Not really sidekick, because this isn't like superheroes where you have sidekicks. But, um, like a supporting character. Okay, that's, that's a better term, I guess. Um, I, I'm thinking she's going to have a bigger role in the future. You know, since she's been injured pretty dramatically. And that was, that rescue by Eugene, I know this is not his vlog, but it's, that was pretty cool when he carried her out. Um, but I think she'll have a bigger role in the future. Um, because once she recovers, man, she, she's going to have a little bit of a story to tell, because you, you just have a, when you go through any kind of, uh, healing process, even in the real world, if you go through a sickness and then you recover, it's, um, you have something to tell, but in, in the zombie apocalypse, I mean, she almost, she's almost died, and so that's... It's just, recovering from that would be cool. There is an elephant in the corner, of course, that uh, I haven't mentioned. The, uh, the homosexuality factor. Because she's the first homosexual character that was shown on Walking Dead. Um, that we know of. She was openly lesbian. And that's... I, you know, I don't think it matters so much. Sexuality matters so much. In the zombie apocalypse, because it's about uh, it's about survival, you know. You're you're loyal to someone. I'm still I'm I'm so against the promiscuity aspect. I don't, you know, who you love is is one thing. I don't care, but if you love multiple people, I'm just like that's kind of weird. I don't like promiscuity like that. Um, you've, you've got to be monogamous in that you've got to show your dedication. And she shows a lot of loyalty and dedication. She had one girlfriend. That girlfriend has died. And since then, I don't think she's, she has not had anybody. Um, and there's actually been few romantic, romantic entanglements at all, at all on The Walking Dead, which is, I, I is welcome to me. I, I just was really afraid, you know, there'd be too much he said, she said drama, but there's really not too much of that. I mean, of course there's some because, you know, relationships happen, but, um, yeah, not a lot of that. But uh, talking about the homosexuality thing, I think, I, I really sense she's open to both sides because she's young and, and when you're young and you haven't really explored a lot and like I said in the zombie box it doesn't matter it, it, it's loyalty it's commitment it's you know I think something's going to happen between her and Eugene it might be platonic but there's going to be a relationship there and because he sacrificed a lot to save her, and so that's a, that's a big deal. I mean, because for him to actually do something, because he's been kind of a wuss the whole time, for him to actually actively do something, it took a lot. And you know, you can tell he's got like a crush on her, but it's it's like, so I I just think something's gonna happen between the two, and. Um, yeah, that's it's, it's weird, but I, I think it will. I think um, in this uh, in the 
sexuality relationship aspect, this is going to take The Walking Dead to a different level. I mean, maybe something that we haven't seen before. But I'm so excited for season six because I know a lot's going to happen.